surface as we go throughout the day. Um, you may see a few clouds filtering in late this afternoon, but that forecast looks to be staying dry for us. Tuesday, another bright sunny sky going to be seeing this dry weather settling in this week. We sure could use that rain, but sadly 0% chance for rain all the way through Friday. And the updated drought monitor is showing a severe drought for most areas in that burnt orange. The driest conditions are in the western big country, seeing a exceptional drought in Mitchell County. That exceptional drought is um, expanding east into Nolan County. So um, we sure could use some rain, especially off to the off to the, off to the west for this afternoon. Highs back in the hundreds, so it's going to be another scorcher out there with this oppressive heat. Make sure to practice heat safety. Make sure to hydrate, wear loose fitting clothes, check on pets, take some breaks out there because this heat will um, be very um, uncomfortable for us. And then this heat looks to be settling in. The average high for this time of year around 94 degrees. Each day well above that. The hottest temperatures will be as we head into this upcoming weekend. First day of summer Tuesday, and it sure will feel like that. Good news is it's going to be a dry heat Monday, Tuesday, but by midweek though that humidity that humidity does increase a bit. So Wednesday will be in that a bit sticky range for Abilene today. High around 102 sunny skies with a breeze tonight will eventually become mild with a low around 77 with a slight breeze. Brownwood today 100 degrees sunny skies overnight 74. So we'll become pleasant after a very hot day. This rest of that seven day. The summer like heat is going to be settling in each day well above average and the hottest temperatures heading into this upcoming weekend. Sunday does have that cold for us, but not looking like it's going to cool us down much high still in the hundreds and it still looks to be staying looks to be staying dry. 